Assalamualaikum everyone. My name is Rubab Zehra, lecturer in English at Kursar College for Women, AJ2 Islamabad. In this short video, we will discuss position of adverbs. You know, ad adverb is a word that adds to the meaning of a verb, an adjective or an adverb. But here we are talking of how can you place an adverb in a sentence. In creative writing, while having a conversation with someone, you must know the proper placement of adverbs. So here are four frequently used positions of adverbs. First one is adverb of manner, like they particularly show you how an action has been done, are generally placed after the verb or the object. So there are two placements. Like for example, in the first example, the ship is going slowly. So at the end, it's basically defining that it is used after the verb. So this is one of the placement. Another example that it is also used after the object is, he does his work carefully. Now work is an object here. And after the object, we have the adverb that is adverb of manner. Okay, now in the second example, Adverbs are also placed after the subject. Many times it happens. For example, he usually comes late. He frequently comes late, etc. So after the subject, the adverb is placed. In the third part, commonly used adverbs like always, like sometimes, etc. They are even used in the start of a sentence. For example, always tell the truth. For example, always look for the positive-minded people in your life because it is very good. Because if you think positive, the impact on your personality and the people around you will always be positive and good. So remember to be positive. Okay, fourth and last one. Adverbs are also placed after the helping verbs. So after the helping verbs and then here in the start of a sentence, and there after the subject. So coming to the last example or the last point, when adverbs are also placed after the helping verbs, the examples are, he will never come again. Or there could be other examples you may use, like for example, he will, or you may say, etc. Means instead of never, you may use any other adverb that is used in its place. So this is it for today. I hope because of this very brief but very clear approach, you will come to know how to place adverbs in your written or spoken activities. For the, till the next video, just take care of yourself and before going anywhere, just don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Learn English with Rubab. Allah peace.